Black Knight time. This is uh, Kane Saber V uh, redone. It's a completely rebuilt version of Kane Saber V. So what I found initially when I made Kane, the first Kane Sabers, they were for women, um, smaller human beings, um, and the uh, thick polycarbonate blades were fine to support their weight. But what I found is you get over, you know, two two twenty five or so you uh, tend to have an issue. And, and the current crop of clients are all fellows of, um, shall we say, a little bit more girth. So uh, this is a full acrylic blade. Um, and this should be able to support up to 300 pounds at least. Uh, so this is uh, hopefully going to do the trick. Now this one and hopefully you can see it well. It lights up great. The acrylic, anybody who knows, knows acrylic blades do light up well. I have a custom pommel insert there. Um, there you go. Oh, this actually, sorry. And it has the clash is actually working. But one of the neat things about this, and I think I should be able to do it with one hand, is you pop the pommel, if I can get the speaker out. Yeah, I think so. There's the speaker and battery pack. You notice that there's a switch here. There's a switch right there. Click that. And then you, I don't know if I can get this back in without any. There we go. I'm not going to put the pommel back on. Now watch. No flat, no clash anymore. That one little clash you heard, you know, MR boards. If the batteries pop out, they'll restart. But uh, anyway, so you flip that little switch, and there's no clashing. So he can have it on and walk around without it clashing. All right. So anyway, that's Kane Saber V uh, redone. And thanks for looking. And we'll see you next time.